Welcome to 8th grade English. I am your child's 8th grade English teacher, Mrs. Marissa Tyler, and I am entering my 7th year here at Midlakes. While this year has thrown a lot of obstacles at us, I look forward to the challenges that arise and the opportunities to grow and learn with your students throughout the entire year. I know that they will be successful no matter what the world throws at them. This year, we'll be reading the following major works. The book Inside Out and Back Again by Tan Ha Lai, The Diary of a Young Girl by Anne Frank, and The Omnivore's Dilemma by Michael Pollan. Right now, we have started reading Inside Out and Back Again by Tan Ha Lai. It features a young girl by the name of Ha. She and her family are from Vietnam and they are forced to flee the city of Saigon at the height of the Vietnam War. She and her family become refugees who board a Navy ship that seeks safety on American soil. When we complete that book, we'll move on to a short unit on short stories or poetry before the winter break, after which we will begin reading The Diary of a Young Girl by Anne Frank. Anne Frank a real person who was deeply affected by World War II and the Holocaust and Hitler's reign will offer us great insight into her life while she and her family are forced to hide in an attic attached to her father's warehouse. They stay here for two years with another family cramped tight behind a secret bookcase in order to avoid being captured by Adolf Hitler and his Nazi SS police and Gestapo. Finally, we'll conclude the year by reading The Omnivore's Dilemma by Michael Pollan, an interesting document that uh, investigates where our food comes from and how it's sourced. Kids will learn about four major food chains that they encounter every day in their daily diets. In addition to reading these works, students will learn how to develop their current writing skills, communication skills, and new technology skills as we all navigate our new life online. Hopefully this will not last the entire year and I will get to meet them at some point in this classroom. I know that we all are excited for that day. Just a few reminders. As we navigate our virtual world, please be sure to check Schoology daily for updated assignments and due dates. Everything that we learn in class can be found on Schoology. Students should, be always, should always be prepared with the book we're currently reading when they attend class. I post Zoom links in the update section of Schoology every night before class starts. I also send the Zoom links in a message to students so they can access it from two different places. Additionally, some helpful tips for you as parents. In the material section of your student's ELA course on Schoology, you will find a help folder that serves as a place for helpful tricks that might help you navigate some technology issues that can arise at home. There's some how-to guides there on what students should do if they are late to class, if they are going to miss class, and if they have a late assignment to turn in. I've also uploaded some videos that show you how to do some simple tasks that kids have to do in class pretty much every day. One of these videos is submitting assignments. If your child has any issues with submitting assignments, please direct them to the help folder on Schoology. There is a video inside that will show them what to do when this happens. There's also a folder titled Previous Assignments. If students miss class or start to get behind in class, Inside the previous assignment folder are all of the weekly folders we've completed so far. These remain open and all of their past assignments remain inside those folders. 
If your child starts to fall behind, please encourage them to visit the previous assignments folder so that they can look for the work that they've missed. Everything will be there. If they have any questions, comments, or concerns, please have them message me on Schoology. Lastly, at the top of the material section of Schoology will always be our current weekly folder. Each week, I post a new folder with the date so that students know that that is where we are working for the entire week. Once the week concludes, I then move that folder inside the previous assignments folder. If you ever need to contact me, my email is mliberati at midlakes.org. You are also welcome to message me on Schoology, and I will return your message as soon as possible. Thanks for coming to Open House, and I hope that next year I see some of your faces in these halls. Have a great night.